a passion project and a source of pride for Omar Muradlu. He runs a mechatronic company that produces and develops agriculture technologies. Not long ago, he spotted a huge gap in the market. I'm a computer engineer and my family has been farming for years. After the cotton harvest in 2019, my father asked me if there was any machinery to collect the cotton that had spilled on the ground and remained as residue. I did global research and saw that there is no such robot. This was a turning point for me and we started our Afara project to export all over the world. His signature project, called Afara, uses image processing technology to navigate the fields and vacuum up spilled cotton. It's drawn attention from international and local cotton producers and attracted investment from agriculture technology developers and dealers. Cotton is a very important product in the world, but most of them goes to waste during the harvest. When we saw this project, we decided to invest. A high-tech project that does not rely on manpower has great potential to both reduce wastage and provide added value for us and for farmers as well. According to the UN's Food and Agriculture Organization, Turkey produces an average of 3% of the world's cotton, but globally, 5 to 20% of the crop is wasted during harvest. That's an average of 140,000 tons of cotton that goes to waste, worth more than $120 million a year. After harvest, up to 100 kilos of cotton can remain on the ground. This is a waste of both product and labor. The labor cost we pay while collecting the cotton left on the ground is very high. That's why a high-tech machine means both time and cost profit for us. Afara is able to collect up to 70 percent of the remaining cotton at the prototype stage. Cutting down wastage is a top priority for the cotton farmers in Turkey, as costs of production are high and cotton is in short supply. Projects like Afara that help them maximize their yield have the potential to boost their businesses and the country's whole cotton industry. Rumeysa Çodar, TRT World, Adana, Turkey.